Good morning world from Tungbo Beach. Such a beautiful part of North Shargao. We're gonna go for a little swim. We've got some sunshine. It looks like a stormy cloud is coming over. <laughs> Poppy's already making a little home for herself. Found anything in there, Poppy? <laughs> you little beast. It does make me laugh. All right, well, we're gonna try and make the most of the good weather before the storm cloud comes over. <laughs> I would like to take Poppy into the water again today. Oh, she's going by herself, I think. Go on, Pops. Go join them. <laughs> You're a mad dog. No, she still hasn't got it. <laughs> Straight back to the hole. Okay, we've switched to the waterproof camera. I'm gonna try and see how Poppy does out in the water. I actually just guided her over. How's the tide? Nice. You wanna swim back to the shore, Story? You can race Poppy. Race Poppy to the shore. She's already in swimming mode. <laughs> Alright, go on, race. There you go, Pops. Look at you go. I'll follow you to the shore. Oh, you're doing really well. That was good. Well done, Pops. How does that feel? Are we going to shake it all off? No? Eden used to do that, but I guess you're not as furry as Eden, are you? Look at you. There you go. You want to go again? How was that? Was that fun? Did you enjoy that? It'd be good if you get used to a bit of swimming, though, Pops. Should we go and see them again? Okay, we're carrying you back out to sea again. You know how much your sister loves swimming. Look, here she comes to see you. Look at you, good swimming story. Yeah, mouth closed, well done. Can you stand there? It's not too deep. You can see actually where the shallow bit is, can't you? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna drop Poppy in. In you go. Look at that, straight back to shore. <laughs> well, at least it's gonna have pulled you off. Nice little morning at the beach. How's life, Pops? How is life? Better get some fresh water now. She's probably swallowed a little bit of salt water. There you go, good girl. This is fun. Water, I will be the po I'll be Poppy. You're gonna be Poppy, are you? <laughs> Doggy paddle. So Daddy is now sitting over there with Poppy in the shoreline because Poppy just kept swimming back to shore, didn't she? Yeah. Yeah, come on then, swim to me. <laughs> swim to me. So this is actually one of the best beaches in the north of the island. It's changed a little bit from the first time that we actually started coming here. It is in the Tungbo area and I think the beach is called Villa Ricky or Villa Rico and they put a barrier now from the road so you have to pay an entrance fee if you're in a car to come here it's only 20 pesos but the first time we came here or actually the first few times we came here there wasn't an entrance fee this is actually also known as the hawaii of the north because of this beach this is what it's looking like from where i'm standing out in the sea we can see the surfers over there as well on the waves we're obviously not going to go out that far <laughs> How's the swimming for you today? Yeah. You enjoying it? Yeah, I'm thinking about going to that big green bit Oh now. no, I think that's a bit too deep. We'll just stay in this bit, I think. So I'm having to hold story now because we've got a bit deeper. We're quite far out now, aren't we? Yeah. Can you stand here or not? <laughs> no. <laughs> Daddy and Poppy are running on the beach. They're doing some running. Exercising all Poppy's energy off. Can I see off. you underwater, please? It has actually just started raining. There's a few drops of rain, which is such a contrast to yesterday. Yesterday's vlog, it was beautiful, sunny, bright blue skies, really, really hot, but the water is still quite warm. It's really enjoyable in here, isn't it? Yeah. I'm yeah. gonna show you underwater. This way? Yeah, that's your face, way.
everybody to see that you are underwater. So I'm going to go underwater first oh. and show you this. <laughs> Sorry, it's raining again. Can you feel the rain? Yeah. Look. And it's cool and nice. It's cool and nice, it is actually. This is so strange that you can see the raindrops. We are swimming in the rain. Can you see the raindrops on top of the water surface? I can. Boom, we've got this big grey cloud. Alright, I think we're going to call it a day for our sea swim story because it's actually really raining now. It's really starting to come down. And Joe and Poppy are just sitting on the sand over there, so not much fun <laughs> for those guys over there. So, should we head back in? Go. Poppy is well and tr truly done with the swimming. <laughs> And it has just started to rain. You can actually see, look, Sasha and Story are just coming out of the water now, making their way back to us slowly. I guess it doesn't really matter so much when you're in the sea. For me and Poppy though, there's only so long we can sit here <laughs> before we get totally soaked. We are gonna go head off and get some lunch at the Coconut Nut, see if they've got some smoothie bowls for lunch. That would be nice. I was just talking to this kid. He was teaching me Bisaya. The numbers one to six. Can you teach me the numbers again? Pisa, Doha, Toyo, Toyo, Upat, Lima, Onom. Oh, oh, yeah? Okay, Salamat. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that was a nice little interlude, a bit of Bisaya lesson, and the kids have gone back into the sea. Ready for lunch yet? Yeah. The rains have come. I know. <laughs> it's um. In the sea still though. Yeah, it's it feels really good. It's cloudy and grey here, but it's actually still warm and lovely. Oh, uh, story enjoy it? Yeah. <laughs> sea glass. You found a new sea glass for your um, collection? Oh, nice. That can go in your shell box. You know your sea shell box? Yeah. That's lost now. No, it's not. It's at home. I don't know where it is. Mm, we'll find it. Love this. When the fishermen finish their fishing, they come out of the sea. Everyone runs over to help them lift the boat out of the water and then back up into the little parking spot that that little kid has just come over to help. Whoa! That was a good call to leave when we did. Look at this. Absolutely pouring with rain now. So, yeah, we got soaked coming back to the car. We actually always did know that this was the forecast for the afternoon, but we knew there was like an hour's window, which was just now, where we could be on the beach and get a little swim in. So we made most of that. Now we're gonna go and grab some lunch. We have sought shelter at the Coconut Nut Cafe. Stur is pretending to walk the plank with Pirate Dad. <laughs> and we've just made our order for lunch. We are getting a pizza. Looking good. I can see some paprika on those fries. This is the first time we've tried out the smoothie bowls from the Coconut Nut. It's looking nice and deep, isn't it? It's a big bowl. Yeah. Oh, it is, yeah. Nice toppings on there. Poppy's off for a rainy explore. I wonder where she'll end up. Normally Ginger's here, but there's no other dogs, so Poppy's got free reign of the place. What's under there, Story? What flavour? It is mango! Mango flavour? Hi. Is it recording? Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Just wanted to say hi. Mango, Banana, yeah. coconut, mango, and crust. Crust. <laughs> so they're like rice puffs, aren't they? Raisins. Yep, some granola. Uh, 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 and chia seeds. Granola. Nice. I'm doing slow motion for you. Come on then, let's see your slow motion. Oh, that is slow. Look at that steady hand. Is it going to get all in your mouth? I can't get all in my mouth. <laughs> oh, that was a fast motion. <laughs> it turns out they had some pizza dough left over from the weekend. So we actually got the last one they've got here. <laughs> so we actually got one of everything. Some tropical vibes here with a veggie pizza and the smoothie bowl and the chips. Yeah. All sharing together, aren't we? It's a strange combo with a smoothie bowl and pizza. It it's is. not your obvious choice. I'm kind of treating this like a drink slash dessert. Dessert, yeah, exactly. <laughs> this is the side. And chips. 
Yeah, they like the side, aren't they? And Poppy's been enjoying the chips too, hasn't she? I'm going to get that one. Oh, thank you. Delicious. The sun has just come out as we're leaving, sniffing in all the smells of the other doggies that are usually here. <laughs> did everyone have fun swimming and enjoying time out by the beach? I did, yeah. Really I did. Nice. It's one of my favourite parts of the north. Yeah. Tungbo Beach, Allegria Beach. I know, it's stunning up here. Although we are leaving like at the wrong time now. We got here in the pouring rain. <laughs> yeah, you do have to learn to read the forecast a bit differently here. I can hear someone singing away doing some video K. It's a very popular thing to do here in the Philippines. It's karaoke. Looking at this beautiful house here at the end. This was the beach that I sat with my mum when she was still here on the island. Slowly, that's it. Look, this is the trick story. You have to do gentle tugs on the lead until she slows down. Yeah, so when you're walking, when she starts pulling, you gently tug it. Ah, oh, it's not working. <laughs> It's such a shame there's so much old plastic lying around here. Such a beautiful location right by the beach. This is like prime space. And all of this is just blown up, left on the floor. We're all clean and fresh from the shower, including Poppy, who's had a little wash. Haven't you, you sweetie dog? She's so smooth, isn't she? I'm just doing some editing over there. And we are just about ready to put this puppy bot together. So did you know that this robot that we're building, well, I think you didn't know this, well, it happened by this. It can actually move its head. Isn't that really cool? And it has a solar panel on, the head, on its head. Have you ever seen a solar panel robot before? <laughs> so if you watched the previous vlog, we just finished putting together the gearbox and the solar panel head of the robot and now we're going to turn it into one of the 12 different varieties. Which one did you choose? The puppy bot. The puppy bot. So basically we need to build another gearbox now. It's going to take some time, Story. Oh yeah, me, because look at all that work that Daddy did. Yeah. My okay. dad did. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you helped. You did all the parts, didn't you? Yeah. Well, I basically sorted them out in these little bags. Yeah, you did the bagging. Right, should we put it together? Yes, Daddy! Ta-da! We finally finished it, didn't we, Story? Mm -hmm. Are you happy with the puppy bots? Yeah! But what's the problem now? We can't test it, can we? No! Why not? There's no sun. It only works when the sun is really bright, doesn't it? Yeah, because it has a soil upon its head. But it was quite a complex thing, but I had fun. Do you have fun? Yeah. Well, there's more to do. We can build 11 more different types of robot story. Yeah. While we wait for the sun to come out tomorrow, the next thing I need to do is break all of these tiny little pieces out and sand all the edges down and put them into individual bags so that we can build some of the other styles of robot. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Did you, what, what, what? Did you enjoy going for a swim today? Yes. <laughs> what was your best part of the day? What, what, what? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what was your favourite part of the day? <laughs> That's all I'm going to get out of you. Alright, hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time. Bye! Oh my goodness, Poppy. No biting. Nibbler. Always nibbling. There you go, nibble on your toys. Why am I being filmed? You were filming me. <laughs>